What is up, my fellow Chibits? Today I'm here to bring all of you the weekly Chibi vlog. So, I'm gonna answer one question that some of you have asked for the past couple days, because obviously some of you didn't watch the bet video I made this past weekend. So to clarify, the reason why my hair is purple is because a long time ago, before our community was over 10k, I made a promise saying that if someone was to ever send me purple hair dye, I would definitely dye my hair. And so, I did that. I dyed my hair purple. Now, here's the thing. The hair dye that the Chibit sent me, and the video I made on it earlier this weekend, was not permanent hair dye. The thing is, is the hair dye didn't even work. The hair dye didn't even make my hair purple, and as I promised, I would make sure my hair was purple. So to keep my end of the bargain, I decided to go out, I went to my local store, and bought some purple hair dye, which is actually permanent hair dye. So, I'm stuck with this purple hair for a little bit. Let's just put it that way. I'm stuck with it, maybe until I cut my hair next time. So for now, that is why my hair is purple, and that's probably the time limit for how long my hair is going to be purple. And it's not perfect, and some of you might not, you know, like purple hair, which I understand, but thing is, I was just keeping my word for you fellow Chivas, because that's what I try to do. Sometimes I have to extend the time a little bit longer, but I do try to keep my word as best as possible, and that's why my hair is purple. So now that I've said that, and I've clarified that, I want to ask the question I always ask. Hopefully all of your Chibits' this week has been good, and hopefully you all are doing good. And how has, it, has this week been for all of you Chibits? Has it been good? Has it been bad? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below, because you know how I love getting to see how all of you Chibits are. And so, yeah. Oh yeah, one other thing I want to quickly mention. A couple of Chibits have been asking me for the past couple days, too. Some have been asking me, am I going to be reviewing or talking about One Punch Man's first episode that came out? I already did that. I, I've been asked quite a bit, actually, for the past two days about, am I going to review One Punch Man or talk about it? Which I already did multiple days ago around this weekend. So, there's no reason for me to make another video on episode 1 until the full product comes out in fall 2015. And speaking of fall 2015, I'm already getting questions about when am I going to be making the fall 2015 video, like what will I watch next? That should be going on very soon, probably when things start ending. When anime start ending very soon, that's when I will, you know, make the video. Probably a week before the anime season comes out, like the next anime season, or two weeks before it comes out. Probably where I will make the video at and when it will come out. So now that I've clarified that, let's open up a couple of fan mail packages. I have quite a few packages, and yeah, let's begin. So this first one is by Michael. So I just want to take a few moments to say thank you very much, Michael. It feels like a big brick. Ghost Pepper. Oh, shit. Ghost Pe- Ghost Pe- Oh, shit. Okay, so I'll discuss this in just a second. Give me just a moment. Um, we have some form of plushie. It's like a scholarship or going to college plushie. Is there anything in that? No, it's not. That's cute. I like that. That's really cute. I'll probably sit that back there, probably near Austin right there. I'll sit like right there. That's, oh, that's really nice. Soft. Very soft. Very fucking soft. We have. Whoa. Okay. So you're getting me ready for Halloween, aren't you? Look at this shit. Hmm. I got a good idea, actually. I'm thinking of for Halloween. Now, this is only for you, Chibits, that watch the vlog, you'll know about it. If you don't watch the vlog, of course, you won't know about it. But I'm thinking about for Halloween, for doing, like, an entire week when Halloween gets around. I'm thinking of doing an entire week with a mask on. Like, doing some form of Halloween mask and just wearing it in reviews for, like, the entire week. That's what I think I'm going to be doing very soon because I want to celebrate the occasion of Halloween. Not all countries celebrate Halloween, of course, but, I mean, I want to make something special. Do something a little bit different from normal that would be kind of different for the occasion since it would be like a Halloween week. So yeah, I might actually use this for Halloween, depending. I mean, I had an idea I was going to use that crown that came in, but I might actually use this. I might use the crown on the pumpkin. That'd be badass. But I like that. I really like it. Really nice. It feels nice, too. It has a really nice design to it. Okay, so we have a couple of... I think I already know who this is. This is... Yeah... Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, I could tell by the picture. I already know the cheap that sent this. 
I can tell by the cat. I can instantly tell by the cat. Hmm. Some form of music. See it. See, the hottest new racer in action. It's a game. A PSP downloadable game. Okay, I, I don't know what that is. I don't have a PSP, sadly, but it's a disc. Of some sort. Hmm. New Type USA. Comes with... Wait. Feature trailers. To anime, uh, anime Network. Air Gear. Air TV. Ghost Train. Oh My Goddess Season 2. Oh, shit. There's a lot of trailers on this. Okay. And then we have... A bunch of cats. I, I know the Chibit. Uh, a Chibit sent some stuff before. It's a very old Chibit that's been around way before 10k Chibits. I'm going to assume the reason why he sent some of this is probably because of the hair dye I did. Now, we got some... Oh, something fell out. Ooh! A card? A Mega Man card. What? They make a Mega Man trading card game? Okay. I just learned something new. Let's see. We have... Dear Chibi. I am sending you some old magazines and some other fun stuff as well. As the thing for the 100k video. Your your friend, the great and mighty Hakulius. Thank you. Okay, so a couple of magazines you sent. You sent... A Full Metal Alchemist magazine. Oh, crap. Oh, it even has in... That is old as fuck. This is an old, old magazine just for the fucking Inuyasha. Damn. Ghost in the Shell. Now, that's definitely a blast in the past. And then... An Inuyasha anime inside here. Holy crap. It even has Basilisk on the... I, that's old. It even has... It's even talking about Blood Plus. Blood Plus. That shit's old. But that's a good series, too. If you've never seen Blood Plus, watch that. Oh, look at that. Look at the artwork. Ooh, Gohan Super Saiyan 2. That's badass. Okay. And we have, ooh, Princess, oh no, yeah, Princess Waltz, I think that's it, I guess it's a game strategy guide, Japanese strategy guide, oh, I can't show this shit, there's some graphic content in this, oh god, <laughs> I open it up and I see just a page of titties, and yeah, I can't show that, holy crap, okay, so this is obviously a, um, a hentai game, a visual novel, so, yeah, Damn. And we have... Ooh, a dog. Very different. Wait. November 1st, 1989. Mama, Sam, and her. Ten puppies. Mama, Sam, and her. Ten puppies. Cute. Fucking cute. And... Subasa Chronicles. God. Some old shit in here. And a poster. Posters of anime. Fan service. Fan service. Fan service. And that's about it. Uh, damn. Okay, so let's get back to the ghost pepper thing. Let, let me talk about this. The ghost pepper uh, thing I just was trying to talk about. Depending on your Chibit's reaction. If. I want to fucking regret this. I, I'm going to fucking regret this. I am going to regret this. But. Just, you know what? If this video, yes, I'm going this way. If this video, if this video has 650 likes in two hours after upload, that's if in two hours after upload. See, you all wrecked me in five minutes, but I know not many Cheebits are willing to watch an entire vlog, so I'm going to get you here. Not many cheapers are going to watch an entire vlog just to see this ghost pepper thing. So, I highly doubt you get, we'll get to 650 in 5 minutes or even 2 hours. Well, okay, we have a package here. I'm going to assume this is by Danny. Danny, the one that sent the uh, Bible Black. Speaking of Bible Black, I was very busy this week, and so I couldn't really do that you know, second half of it. But I, I want to get it out next week, as I said. I'll try to get it out. Just been very busy this week. Please forgive me for that. And, yeah, I, I will try to get out the Bible Black second half video very soon. So, look forward to that. Oh, more coffee. You know what? I ordered some of this coffee, actually, two days ago. It was fucking good. I also ordered um, Death by Wish coffee. I don't know how many of you know about that coffee, but I recently got Death by Wish coffee. Yes, the name's kind of fucked up, but it's fucking strong. Oh, I take a swig of that Death by Wish coffee, and it just... I fucking am up. Like, I'm... Like, my head explodes. That's just how much caffeine's in it. It's crazy. 
But I really like this coffee too. It has a really nice flavor. I mean, you put some in, get some uh, French vanilla. Fucking delicious. So, what do we have here? From Danny. I know that you really love this coffee, and I therefore send you more, and so you can stay up to a longer to watch your beloved Hamatora. <laughs> By the way, Bobble Black is on its way. Oh, so you sent this at the time you sent Bobble Black. Yeah, I know Bobble Black, Danny. It came in last week, and... Yeah, I will... Maybe make milestones with those, you know, because some of you were asking me to do that, and I might do that, so we'll see. Oh yeah, next package moving on, we have some form of box shape from Japan. Sent to Chibi. What in the hell? This looks fucking creepy. By Zalfei. Uh, hopefully I'm saying that right. By Zalfei, sent through U USPS, and no Amazon this time, okay. <laughs> I can't show this. I can't fucking show it. You can probably already realize why I can't show it. It's a fucking... A hentai game. <sighs> it's called... Erog. Like in, you know, Arrow. Arrow anime. It, it, it's Erog. It says PC game 18+. Sex and games make sexy games. That's its slogan. It's called Erog. Sex and games make sexy games. That's fucked up. Okay, so... There is no letter with this, so no comment. The Elmopi, though, they got a fucking keyboard between them. You know what? I'll, I'll stop. I'll, I'll stop. I'll, I'll stop. I'll stop. Oh my god, why? Why? What the hell, Cheebits? You're trying to fucking pervert me, man! Yes, I'm not joking. Another fucking hit. <laughs> oh my god, seriously. It's called Love Infusion. Oh my. Oh my, that hentai. Oh my. Okay, so l let's just, let's retrace this real quick. I'm sent a game, a game guide. On a game I don't own, but it has just the fucking tits in it. Just yeah, I, I, I'm sent a hentai game, 18 plus. Okay, and then I'm sent a hentai manga by Project H Love Infusion by Rinya Sabashi. And then on top of that, you send me Ghost Pepper. Well, this is definitely kind of... I'm gonna have to drink this because thirstiness. <laughs> Dude, I, I have no words right now. I have no words. There's so... What the fuck? There's so many of them. Like, look at this. There's so many. What the fuck? Okay. What the hell's going on here? Uh, I mean, I've, ta I've tasted these before. They're really good candy, but... What the fuck is going on here? Okay, there's some form of letter. Uh, let's see. Chocolate truffles. Ooh, that's fucking good. I love my chocolate. Is there a letter in here? Am I missing, like, a letter? Here, I'm gonna pull everything out. Give me a second. I'm gonna pull all this candy out. Pull all this. I don't see a letter. I'm just gonna say whoever sent this, thank you. Like, a bunch of fucking candy. Like, Wait, there might be a name on this. From... There's no name. I don't know. Oh, yeah, so... Whoever sent this candy, you know who you are. Thank you. Um... I'm just... So much candy. So much fucking candy. So much candy. Gonna need something with uh, my thirstiness when it comes to... <laughs> oh, yeah, so... A bunch of fucking games. Wow. Okay. That that's uh, gonna be a nice, good late night snack night when I watch some more anime and stuff. So yeah. So this letter is by Tristan. So thank you very much, Tristan, for sending this letter. You know, I love my letters, and I love seeing what you cheebits think about everything, and just giving me your thoughts. It's always fun to do. Oh, what a gummy! Oh, that's so great. Okay, so we got oh a bunch of more. We got paper cranes and... Oh, that's so good. Okay. 
I think, yeah, is this the same Chiba that sent me paper cranes once a, uh, a long time ago, about a couple weeks or a month back or so? I think this might be the same Chiba. I think it was a Tristan that sent it. Dear Chibi, thanks so much for reading my first... Okay, it is the same Chiba. Thanks so much for reading my first letter. No problem. I love reading all of your Chiba's letters. It's an inspiration and inspires me to be better. I know my name is on the rare side of the spectrum of names, so for future reference, most people pronounce it as uh, Tristan. I really enjoyed the second season of SAO and can't wait for the release of the light novel English. Yeah, I think there's like five or six volumes already out of SAO now, actually. They're about to be getting into the Mother of Sorrow. Let's see. Waiting for the release of the English light novel of Mother of Sorrow. Oh, yeah, okay. I, you spoke for me. I shouldn't have spoke my mouth. I should get my mouth shut. Because watching the episode was a one-way ticket to Philadelphia. <laughs> I noticed that you have never seen any Gundam. If you're interested, I recommend that you watch Mobile Suit Gundam 00. It's a more political and I guess more mature than the rest of the other series and looks badass to boot. It's just awesome and my favorite series of the ones I've seen. I also recommend Gundam Wing or the 08th uh, MS team. Last letter I remember joking a little about Monster, uh, Monster Muzumi and how I thought it was just a super etchy manga slash show with monster girls. I'm on chapter 22, and to be honest, I'm thoroughly, enjoy I'm thoroughly impressed with the show and think it's freaking hilarious, and it is really just a good series. I agree with that. I like how the MC is actually competent and well-built compared to most other harem MCs that make you yell at your screen. I fucking completely agree with that one. So far, my best girl is still Mia, followed closely by Poppy and then Sabina. I want to end this letter by asking you some fun and hopefully quick questions. Who is your best girl so far in Monster Musume? As I said in my latest review, I'm shifting more over to Sue recently, but I still am a Mia fan. She's still one of my favorites. What's your favorite harem ecchi series? <laughs> to Love Room. To Love Room. What's your favorite OTP or couple? Lawrence and Holo. Least favorite anime cliche? Probably hot springs, bah, spa, and beach episodes. I, I fucking just I fucking can't stand that shit, man. It just it gets me so bad. It just kills pacing. Have you ever been to a convention, and what was it like? Never been to a convention. Hopefully one day I can to meet up with you fellow achievements. What was the watch order for the Fate series again? Okay, so... Oh, oh shit. The watch order of the Fate series. Getting into the cold hard facts here. Visual novel players will tell you different, and then anime onlys will tell you different. So, I'm just gonna say, I'm going to look at this as an anime only. I'm not even gonna look at it as a visual novel, because majority of people don't want to sit down and play a visual novel. Now that I've said that, visual novel players, understand me. Not many people want to read a visual novel and take many hours reading a long visual novel just to get the proper route of the story. So... What I recommend as the anime-wise, when it comes to what current content is out, I'm not talking about Heaven's Feel because that's not even out yet as a movie. So, I'm going to say, personally, as anime only, start with Fate Zero, and then watch Karno Kyokai, just to get a little, little bit more understanding of Type Moon and how they work, and, you know, affordable. After you finish Fate Zero and you get to see, you know, Karno Kyokai, I recommend moving over to probably either A... Fate Stay Night, the original 2006 adaptation that is kind of shit, but it just depends. Or move over into, you know, Fate Stay Night Unlimited Blade Works. And if you want to enjoy the series even more, you could, depending on how you want to view the content, you could probably watch Fate Khalid after you see Fate Stay Night Unlimited Blade Works, or before. It just really depends on spoiler reasons or what you really want to view in terms of content. But I would recommend of anything, if you do want to have the best start, watch Fate Stay Night, actually, the 2006 version, which kind of looks cruddy and didn't follow the story properly, but if you can look past that, that's a good way to start, you know, the anime-only route, but if you don't want to see that, I recommend start with Fate Zero, move over into Karno Kyokai, and then go into Fate Stay Night Unlimited Blade Works, and then probably watch Fate Khalid after that to get a little bit more understanding of some of the characters in the universe, and then, I guess, wait for Heaven's Fill to come out. There you go. Now that I've said that, there you go. Okay, so is that all of it? And have an awesome day from Tristan. P.S. Never watched that Chibi Fad video. <laughs> never watched that. Oh, yeah, that Chibi. Oh, wow. That's a long time ago. Damn. Can't wait to remember that. Thank you very much, Tristan. I'm glad I can answer some of your questions. It's always fun ending or beginning one of these videos with a letter, so thank you very much. And you all have a wonderful day or not wherever you live. And like I said, 
depending on how many likes this gets in like you know two hours tell me your thoughts comments below you all have a wonderful day or not wherever you live please be safe chibi out